Yo, 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 shout out Apex, bro. How quick did he fix Ooh. that, man? Hell yeah. That's what like, that's professional right there. Hell yeah. We're but right we're back. back. And we're back as usual with <clears throat> left field questions. You guys, I don't know if you're familiar with left field questions, mm. but we're going to ask you some stuff not so music related. Okay. Maybe a little bit, but it's going to be a little bit uh, stranger than the usual question. Um, let's start it off with this one here. How we doing it? I answer one, he answer one. You both. can both answer oh, the okay. questions, I guess. Or if you guys want to right, you know, alternate. Got, I, I'll start it off. I'll start off. Yeah. Since he's uh, over here getting his game on over here, oh, he, he got he got to drip the swag. Oh, yeah. oh, he got the reptile what? underneath the reptile. Is, is that? Underneath you know, the reptile. he got a cord. In uh, is that your favorite Nickelodeon show? If not, what is? Oh nah. Uh, my favorite Nickelodeon show is Hey Arnold. Oh, that's, uh, that's the reason why I wore the reptile. And the reptile, because I don't know if y'all remember um, Boomerang, I the scene with John Witherspoon, uh-huh. R.I.P. One of yeah, the yeah, goats. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. The oh, first yeah. time I ever saw him, 
He comes in and he's wearing the mushrooms, the mushroom yeah. soup, the mushroom uh-huh. sock, the mushroom belt. <laughs> and he was like, you know, you got to match. You got to coordinate. Yeah. Uh-huh. You know, I want to come here and I want to coordinate uh-huh. today. You know what I mean? You got the to show a little respect the to one of the goats, shirt. man. Hell yeah. yeah. The, the man. pink reptile. The reptile. Pink and reptile. then you got the, the lick my pussy uh, hat. All day, man. You got to <laughs> yeah. coordinate. He yeah. passed for that one. He get an A plus for that one. <laughs> How about you, D.Y.? What's your favorite uh, uh, cartoon back in the day? Oh, uh, well, my favorite cartoon is uh, Doug, but my favorite all-time show that I ever played on Nickelodeon was uh-huh. Clarissa Explains It All. Oh, I don't know if what? you remember that show. Of course I remember. But Clarissa my first it crush all. ever was, was Melissa Joan Hart, bro. Okay. Yeah, so all right, Clarissa all right, all right. It all, bro. Everyone else was the Pink Ranger. The answer yeah, yeah, looking for yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Shout out to I'm Pink Ranger. That, though. Yeah. All right, guys, how about this one? What's the last song you want to hear while you're fucking? Oh, yeah. the last song. Not like this is what I'm going to finish to. Like, I don't want to hear this song. <laughs> like, either you change when the song or I'm fucking. I'm just going to gonna say, turn my mood off. I'm just going to say Happy by Pharrell because Word. I fucking hate that song. Word, that's, it's that's just, a bonus it's just the most cringiest song yeah, of all time, rough. bro. So I'm not trying to hear What about that, that one he did um from that, that TV show? I forget what it was called. It was so bad I don't remember it. I'm not it even sure. It came out last summer. It was worse than Happy. I probably know it if I heard it. It was way worse than Happy. <laughs> I honestly like Happy. You like Happy? Yeah. I'm smooth yeah. on it, bro. It depends on the vibes. Bro. What about you, Mike? Mash, it can fuck up my mood, but I can oh. tell you right now, uh, if any Nas song, song come <laughs> on, <laughs> while I'm doing anything, not just fucking, while I'm eating, uh, while I'm out cooking, not hungry no while more. I'm working out, <laughs> like, if you play any Nas song while I'm doing anything that brings me joy, it'll ruin my mood, and anything oh. push your teeth. Okay. So, yeah, I'm straight, bro. Don't I'm not trying to hear that gloomy shit. Ooh. Nah, man, I'm not no trying to hear about that same no cocaine. J. Cole. J. Cole don't make me mad, it just makes me yeah, sleepy. Yeah, makes me sleepy. All right. Yeah. All right, all right. J. Cole is night, bro. That's fair. Uh, how about this? I like them though. Uh, first, Mike, what's your favorite movie? It's a two-parter, by the way. That's not the question. That's an awful question. <coughs> yeah, that's that's, that's a solo yeah. question. That's a two-part. That's the first part of it. Ah, shit, bro. I don't really have a favorite movie. Well, give man. me a movie that you like that you can think of. Uh, Blended. All right. Okay. Um, yeah. re if you could recast Blended, say the two top ca- characters. That's um. Adam okay, Sandler, Adam Sandler and Drew Raymore. If you could recast them, who are you putting in the place? Shit. Uh, myself. All right. I, I think like I that. would body that. And you and your girl? <laughs> uh, <laughs> honestly, I would do me and my girl just so that we could have that paid trip yeah. to Africa. Right. <laughs> and she's a good actress. I'm yes. a good actor. Uh-huh. I think, you know what I mean? And uh, yeah, man, I had that paid vacation to Africa with my girl. Okay. Yeah, you know, now she throw that out there. I would love, you know, and me and her work together recently. Oh, I would like that. Okay. So blended starring Mike Ross and Destiny. Yeah, man, oh, I think that right. would be nuts. And how about for you? What, what, what movie would you like to recast? Oh, uh, doesn't even have to be. It could be if you'd like. You could be a movie you hated well, the cast of, but you thought my could have favorite made movie is Home Alone Two: Lost in New York. Oh shit! Okay. I got random favorites, y'all. Right. Home That's Alone right. Two: Lost in New York is my favorite. You gonna re- um, recast Trump? I think for, <laughs> for <laughs> Trump scene. I think that. for Harry. <laughs> For Harry and Marv, I think I'm gonna go with D Nota. D Nota's about to be Marv. Okay. And then, and then my guy, my guy Naldo's about to be Harry because uh, he's one of the just funniest motherfuckers I know. So D Nota and Naldo are gonna be Harry and Marv, yeah. And, and, and Kevin McAllister stays himself. Yeah. Really, the whole rest of the cast is the same. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess I don't really, yeah. I don't know too many little kids that's, besides that's my fair. kids. You know what I'm saying? That's fair I ain't enough. Gonna, <laughs> I, I don't know. All right, all right, all right. Um, you guys got any left field questions? I got a sports one. Hit me. Oh. Uh, if you could give an injury pill to one player. Oh, I already know. Who yeah. would it be? Injury pill. Like, like their injury, injury goes away. Yeah. I already know. Who you got? You got anybody? Because I know mine. And don't, nah, don't, man. Don't, don't nah. say Kyrie. Derrick Rose, bro. D. Rose. Oh. I, I think, I think oh. Derrick oh. Rose, bro. Oh, had that's like that's crazy that's potential. Oh my goodness, he's ridiculous. He won an MVP at 21 years old. He was already just so dominant. We never seen speed and athleticism like him, and he wasn't even close to his prime, bro. So yeah, I would right. give that pill to Derrick Rose because I think he had unbelievable. Like, that's potential. a great answer. Hell yeah! Oh, I Derek actually Rose. take that back. Answer. I do have an answer. Uh, nah, <laughs> bro, no bullshit. I was nice. I was blew out my knee, but nah, not me. Um. Mine's would be uh, LeBron last year. Okay. Because um, Golden State fell apart, and yeah. I'm a diehard Laker fan, and you I 100% believe that they would have beat Kawhi, bro. Mm-hmm. I'm not a Kawhi believer. 
I would never be a Kawhi believer. Ooh. I think that nigga's weird. He's very weird. And he never played. It doesn't mean he's not good at I don't basketball. Know y'all he's like a weird him. guy. I also don't <laughs> like James Harden, but whatever. Oh, right. oh yeah, I, I got a good one. On I got Harden, a good one. Bro. What's that? That's a good segue to my next Damn question. Niggas, uh, 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 Who travels more, James Harden? James Harden. <laughs> or, or Carmen San Diego. James, James Harden. Harden. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even have Easy, James Harden. I don't even answer. need to know who the Easy. second is. James Harden. James bro. Harden, bro. James Harden is just yeah. a clown, bro. I can Waldo spend the next don't travel more 30 years yeah. talking. I just don't like James Harden, bro. Fuck James Harden. Call me a hater. Right. I don't even care. I hate James Harden. It's documented James on his Facebook too, bro. page. Uh, that's cool. I don't like, I don't like, I'm, I'm, in that, I'm in that same bandwagon. Bro, and it's funny, yo. I don't even be hating athletes and shit. Yo, Donnell will tell you. I'm like one of the few people, like, I don't really hate on other teams. I don't really hate yeah. athletes, bro. But, like, dog, niggas just drives me crazy, oh, man. Him <laughs> and uh, Rudy Gay. And it has nothing uh, to do with anything. Oh, I just hate Rudy like Gay's I like, bro. I Rudy like Rudy. Gay. Oh, no, 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 bro. Hey, yo, it has nothing to do with his game. Yeah, I hate weird. when he talks. I hate his face. It's I hate, no I hate like, yeah, <laughs> bro. Face. I also hate his name. Like, your name's Rudy, Rudy bro. Your name's Rudy, and then your last name's name is Gay. Rudy, <laughs> like, Rudy Gay. Like, bro, I hate him. I wasn't that the actual it. player? Wasn't there Rudy Gay in the league? Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I fucking hate Rudy Gay, bro. Uh, that's nothing to do with him. Uh, uh, you know man. what? That's how I used to feel about Mario Chalmers. Yep. Yeah, he, yeah, was, like, he was a little pest. Yeah, yeah. yeah like, I was really. just like, yo, there's something about it. I just don't like that. Yeah, he was a little, yeah. was a little like, pest. Uh, yeah. Crazy. Yeah, man. Some people just rub you the wrong way. Right. Like, you they don't even got to do like, nothing. They just look at you. You're just that's, like, ah, mm-hmm. fuck that's you. That's James Harden. Yeah, be like, yo, bro. I don't really know him, but if I ever saw him in person, I'd definitely trip that nigga. <laughs> 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 like, I ain't going to hit him. He mad big, but I'd definitely trip that nigga. <laughs> nah, All right, ready for another little nah, field? So what, what's one thing you would change about Boston? Ooh. You, you got for the better, for the better, <laughs> the you gotta go left field. Go no, left. I'm gonna tell you right now. The one thing I would change about Boston is that I'm tired of motherfuckers not giving me my credit, bro. Uh-huh. And not the gotcha, people. Bitch. I mean, all of the other media people, man. Like, I'm tired of all these lists. Mm-hmm. I'm tired of every time y'all promoting somebody for these shows. Yeah. It's somebody else that ain't me. And any, and it's not even hating, bro. I'm glad niggas is doing well. Do right. your thug thizzle. But at the end of the day, bro, I at least want an honorable mention. Like, who's Whatever. making this list? And like, what the, what's the criteria to make this list? Yeah, yeah bro. Ass. Like, dog, I don't <laughs> have Absolutely. packed shows. Uh-huh. I don't have hundreds of thousands of views. Yep. If you if you add up all my views from yep. Facebook and YouTube, I'm at a million plus. Word. Like, you sit there, do the math. Yep. That's on God. Like, what else I got to do, bro? <clears throat> like, bruh. Yeah, I, I, bruh. Yeah, what a nigga gotta do, bruh? Definitely I'm about to make an OnlyFans and just retire. Like, I'm tired of <laughs> shit, man. I'm about to just sell porn, dog. Word. <laughs> Catch my gun, chat your bait next week. <laughs> so, nah, that's what I would change, man. I would change the way that they grade people and the way that uh, they promote who they promote. Because I think word. it's all bullshit. Uh, Absolutely. That was uh, legit. Me, <laughs> I just feel like, don't get me wrong, I understand artists support other artists. I right. get that. But a lot of Boston artists, especially the ones who don't really have their name up there yet, but they're still trying to get up there, you know what I'm saying? I feel like they just expect all the other artists to promote their shit. Like, they're pushing their music to the wrong people. Like, yeah. they don't understand that you got to build a fan base of non-artists first. Absolutely. Like, you, like yeah. I got my own music to promote and stuff. I can't flood my page with every artist in Boston. I got to promote my own stuff. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, it's one thing to rock with people and promote and push and do all that. Of mm-hmm. course, I do that. But it's like, I'm. that's not my main that's not the main people who I'm trying to push to other artists. Yeah. You got to you gotta get fans who aren't artists. He needs some and milk. that's what a lot of artists need to realize. You mm-hmm. got to stop expecting other rappers to be your fans. Yeah, bro. Because yeah. I only listen to Jay-Z and Drake. I hate to disappoint y'all. Only two rappers I listen to. <laughs> Everybody else is oldie goldies, man. I don't listen to none of this rap shit. I hate it all. Uh, I'm happy you said those names. Because I have a... Um, this one's for the two year. You got to work as a team on this one. As okay. no muzzle... So you know Mary Fuck Kill, right? Of course. You've heard that? Okay. Oh, yeah. I have my own I version of it here on Fully Focused Podcast, and it's uh, Sign, Collab, Diss. I'm going to give you three sign, artists. Collab, diss, You're going right. to sign with one, collaborate with one, and diss one. Okay. And you just gave me two of the names. Let's, let's all pick an artist. All right. Go I'll ahead. go Jay-Z. Okay. Jay-Z. Drake. Okay. Drake. 
and Jada Kiss. And Jada. Okay. Who we dissing, who we signing to, and who we c- just doing a collab with. Uh, I think, should I, should I pick a specific, like this, or just anybody, whatever? Oh, no, he said those three. Yeah, All right, those so are, I think. You can do them individually if you I'm want. I'm going to say, okay, okay. Yeah, you do them individually. Right, I it's think I'm going to sign with. I'm going to sign with Jay-Z, yep. and I think Mike is going to have this same one if I right. know him well enough. I'm going to sign with Jay-Z, Jay-Z. I'm going to collab with Drake, uh-huh. and I'm going to diss Jadakiss. Because I personally... I wanted to put uh, Joe Budden in I there. think <laughs> that Jadakiss <laughs> is one of the more overrated <laughs> rappers. Yeah, He's good. Really? Don't get me wrong. He can rap. He uh-huh. can rap his ass off. But like I posted that thing the other day, like rank the four rappers uh, in terms of bars. Lloyd yep. Banks, Cassidy, Fab, and Jadakiss. You can't put Jadakiss above those four in terms of punchlines, bro. And pe- he doesn't that. have mm. bars like that, bro. He can rap... He he got you know he sticks with what he does like the push a T route the drugs and uh-huh. the, the, you know the hood life and stuff yeah, but he don't got lane. bars like that. Bro. Right. Lloyd Banks, Cass, and Fab they got punchlines they got bars. Uh, yeah. So I'm dissing Jada Kiss, bro. All right. Uh, what about you, Mike? I do think Jada's over Fab. Uh huh. I can't. For do my punchline, I punch would <laughs> take out <laughs> Fabulous <laughs> and put in Little Wayne because I think Fabulous is terrible. Uh, but uh, for my Matt, uh, not Matty Kill, what was it? Sign, so sign, sign collab this. Yeah. Uh, for me, man, it's a no-brainer. Right. Um, I would sign with Hove. Mm-hmm. You know, look at his resume. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I would collab with Drake because yep. look at his resume. <laughs> <bro>. <laughs> right. You know my guy, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I would diss Jada Kiss. Yes. And it's not just because. And I, I love Jada Kiss. Uh-huh. I like him too. But right. you're not hating on him. But I am undefeated in rap beefs. Uh-huh. And Jada Kiss is undefeated in rap beefs. Uh-huh. And I would 100% That's think fair. that I could take Jada Kiss. <laughs> and I think that would really her. be a good feather in my cap yeah. if I knocked off yeah. one of the gods. Mm. If no people, offense to him, but I definitely think I could yeah. take Jada. Mm. All right. That's fair. Oh, I think I could take anybody. Oh, yeah. So, you, you know, you, you feeling frog mindset too. <laughs> Word. Jump, jump. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, how about this one, guys, then? Uh, they made a movie about you today. Who plays you and what's the name of the movie? Oh, that's funny. That's a good question. Thank you. <laughs> um, let me see. Uh, what's, um, my na- the name of my movie would be Married with Five Kids. Married with Five Kids? Yeah, bro. I'm, I, I, got, I got a lot of kids, bro. You All know right. what I'm saying? I'm, I'm a dad, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm living the... The take in life, you uh-huh. know what I'm saying? I'm a homebody with my yeah. kids. Uh, <laughs> and who, and who would play me? Yeah, who plays you? Uh, I'm kind of like a clumsy guy. <laughs> so I think, uh, I think I'm gonna go with, I think I'm gonna go with Steve Carell. Steve Carell. I'm gonna go with Steve Carell. Even like though he's that. white, you know what I'm saying? He doesn't look like me uh-huh. at all, and he's older. Yeah, but I, I, I think he's, he's just funny, bro. He's clumsy. He just says a lot of funny stuff, bro. Mm. I, I go with Michael Scott, bro. All right, Michael oh, Scott, Michael Scott, Steve Scott. Carell. You know How about for you, Mike? What's the name of the movie called? Damn, bro. All right, <laughs> man. This is a good question, bro. Oh, no, nah, nah, it is a good question. And it's funny because I have it. I actually thought about this a lot. Ah. And uh, I do have a two-part answer because I always Perfect. want to do two biopics. Uh, All right. So my real movie, uh-huh. the serious one, would be called Blunts, Bitches, and Beats. Uh, that's um, a serious one, guys. That's a serious that's one. Serious that's one. serious. <laughs> that's Fair a serious enough. All right. Blunts, Bitches, and Beats. Uh-huh. And, um, Smoke at, weed every day. Exactly. And have y'all ever seen um, Sex Ed on Netflix? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah. So the black kid that plays <laughs> Jackson. Uh-huh. I don't know his name, but yeah. I know yeah, what I want him to play me. Yeah. You know what okay. I mean? Because that's a good-looking motherfucker. Yeah. And I want all the girls <laughs> to be thinking about me when they see him playing. Okay. So, yeah, that's what I need. So, all yeah. Right. Um, and what's up? Was it comedy, I guess? Is yeah, and then when I had the comedy one, I'm just going to call that No Muscle Nation. All and right. I want the dude that played Kenny Powers. Yeah. Why well, does No Muscle Nation sound like a serious movie? <laughs> oh, <laughs> bro. <laughs> See, because that's how my mind works, that's bro. Fair. I like to fuck with people. All right. I like fair. to fuck with people. And who plays you in this one? Um, The guy who plays Kenny Powers. He also played. Oh, uh, word. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> bro, you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, oh, the crazy shit. ass white dude, yep. bro. Oh, yeah, I fucking love him. Funny. He's Bond Beyond. And what's his name? Yep. yep. I did Danny McBride. Yep. Danny That's McBride. That's bro. awesome. <laughs> Danny McBride has to play me. All right. In, 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 uh, that yeah. All he right. has to play me in fucking No Muscle <laughs> Nation. Blunt's Bitches and whatever Blunt's sounds like a Danny McBride yeah, movie, by the way. And Ice Cube has to play Hush. Okay. We do No Muscle Nation. BBB. Hush to God. Yeah, and that's the one we can get Steve Carell to play Don. 
Word. The movie would just be nice, yeah. bro. It'd be a uh, wild thing. Uh, speaking of Steve Carell, The Office, you just got into I the office. I just got into it, yeah. Which character you most relate with? Uh, Michael. Michael Scott. Yeah, that he, was a stupid he, question. You you into it at all? The of office? course, bro. I fucking uh, who, love The who, Office. Who are man? you? Who who do you personality match with the best? Honestly, dog. Personality wise, I'm probably Jim because I'm always Jim? playing pranks on people. <laughs> uh-huh. But uh, I think the way my life is shaped, I'm definitely more Charles, like the, the okay. fucking Edris character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, bitches just be bugging. He's awesome. He's awesome. Be bugging. <laughs> the soccer episode was funny as shit. Yeah, <laughs> 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 it took, it took show, me bro. far too long. To yeah. Get oh yeah, you definitely you're were too long. Very late to the club, party, but absolutely. welcome awesome. to the Better party. Better late than never, yo. Yeah. All right, so give me an artist. I mean, not an artist. Give me an athlete. That you want to do a theme song for, and what's the name of the song? Um, so I don't even, I don't, well, my favorite athlete right now is Jason Tatum. Um, so hell yeah, like a theme song, just like uh, not really, <laughs> not really sure how to how to answer this one. Like his like his entry song, we'll make a song for him. Oh, uh, you know I w- I would saying? just call it the Young Goat. Young goat, because that, go. cause that that's that's what Jason Tatum is. He's young goat, sure bro. Is. He's a kid. Hell young yeah. goat, bro. He's a kid. <laughs> like, you know what I'm I mean, I'd make a fire banger called Young Goat. Bro. Okay, that'd be dope, actually. You should, cool. especially right now because it's Corona shit. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Home, make a bro. fire banger. He definitely at home. Shout out to JT, bro. We Yo, miss watching it. you, my guy. Yeah. Um, for me. Uh, It'd probably be Deontay Wilder, man. Mm. I know he got oh, beat okay. by Fury. Oh, yeah. But uh ain't nobody else whipping on his ass. I can no. promise you that. Word. And uh yeah, and mm. I feel like it would be mad badass if Deontay Wilder came out to a Mike Ross song That's fire. and yeah. then beat somebody's face in. Oh, I would man. literally fire. love that shit, bro. Really like so that. yeah, Easy, bro. You know, he country, I'm country. Uh-huh. He like to hit people. I don't really like to hit people, but uh-huh. I like to shit on rappers. So <laughs> yeah, 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 bro, I would yeah. love Oh. To make a Deontay Wilder theme song, I have yeah. knocked motherfuckers out to it. That's All right. Fire. Hell yeah. That's what's up. So, yeah. Wait, all right, I'm going like to get really intellectual on you guys. All right. Waffles or French toast? <laughs> Waffles, man. French well, toast. Well, all right. And, and we get conflicting. Uh, usually, it's like 90% French toast, usually. Why waffles? Um, I think French toast is awful. Uh-huh. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. Are you not an egg guy, or is it just Oh, no, no. I love concept. eggs. Okay. I love toast. Mm. Together, I'm straight. Uh-huh. I don't know who thought that shit was a good idea, but y'all the can French keep it. French thought it was a good it's idea. <laughs> oh, well. I do love waffles, bro, too, though. Yeah, yeah, I do yeah, love yeah. me bro, some waffles. The French have only had two good ideas, bro. Uh, French kiss and an oral sex. Uh, Everything uh, else <laughs> I ever thought about was crazy. Although they crepes are pretty good. Bro, French kiss had a whole midget from the country. Like, come on, stop it. I like crepes. They went from they had a midget. They had the craziest king. Why isn't crepes called French toast? I don't know. Right? That's a good question. No way. They probably ain't making. They're more like pancakes. They're like really thin. They're like paper pancakes. Yeah. (laughs) And you know what? French fries is them too. French fries is good too. And you know we call them that, but I don't think they're. Yeah. Any of them are actually French. Or like French. Or else they wouldn't be called French such and such, probably right. But yeah, man. And waffles. French is, you know, <laughs> French fries are called <laughs> chips. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and waffles are, uh, be it not, man. Uh, waffles are fucking awesome, bro. <laughs> <Hell yeah. laughs> they really are. Waffles, they're great. There's nothing wrong with Waffles are Ooh. literally pancakes with pockets for the serve. It's, yeah, essentially. Yeah. I do so, love me some blueberry waffles egg waffles, waffles, bro. Yeah. Some blueberry not egg waffles. Bro. Bro. You gotta get a waffle. He said not egg. Egg is good, but pancake fresh waffles. I don't know. Those blueberry yeah. egg waffles be smacked. Blueberry is good. Absolutely. The chocolate chips. Y'all ever had a waffle maker waffle? No, I yes, I have. I never have, to be honest with you. I have. Bro, I used to work at restaurant. I have. But those blueberry egg the waffles be, be hitting, smacked. Bro, yo. You can go get <laughs> some blueberries, put that shit in some instant Real. waffle mix, it. and yeah. throw it in a waffle yeah. maker. I, I believe bro, it. I'm going to bless you one day. I have. I got it. Uh, I can't do much, but I can do breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's what I was saying. Elbows. That's what I was saying. Yeah. We got Elbows. the breakfast down on this one. You know. You know, you it's make some bacon man, waffles like, at home. You know, you mm-hmm. get the bacon, you crumble oh, yeah. it all up. Throw that in the maker. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Close yeah. that thing. He know. Yes, make sir. sure you put That's the butter. That's okay. Holla don't holla don't at spray me when it. You want some real food. Don't See, spray man. it with I'm pan. Put butter. <laughs> put the butter inside the waffle maker, then you put the batter. And it's yo. amazing. It's got a nice brown crust. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're so going to turn like this into Rachel Ray instead of pulling. <laughs> 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 yo, ladies, peep, right? 
Y'all gotta pay attention. When this Another dude that one. can cook everything, <laughs> not everything, just practice. He probably one of them, like, you know, one of them boyfriend types. You know what I mean? He probably control them too. Shots, <laughs> shots, right. shots. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, I, yeah. I mean, <laughs> if you get one of them dudes that can only make breakfast, you got one of them guys who who don't been through his whole phase. <laughs> See, he can only make breakfast because he spent all his nights hoeing. Yep. So he only know how to cook Damn! breakfast, bro. I can only make breakfast and sandwiches. That's it. Sick, Everything else. That's pretty much me, too. Is it? See? He was mm-hmm. on. That's pretty much <laughs> He was yeah, on. And now he settled down. what I tell yeah. you? Catch me on you got to get a man that went through his whole phase. I be trying to tell you. Yeah, I already done Watch what it. that nigga can cook, man. If he only cooked done breakfast, marry that man. <laughs> do what you got to do to marry that man. <laughs> All right, let's just keep oh, moving with more uh, left field questions. You guys think any guilty pleasures you can tell us about? Um, You're like, 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 fucking, like, my guilty pleasure is I love boy band music. Yeah, let's like try. Like, 90s, 2000s boy band music. Yes, fucking please. Yeah, and oh. let's, try to keep, <laughs> let's try to keep it down to rated R. <laughs> I mean, lately I've just been back on my Pokemon kick. Okay. Oh, right. I've, been, I've just been back on my Pokemon kick. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. I've, I've actually bought a couple packs of cards the other day. Mm. I'm uh, like, yo, I really want to buy a binder and start collecting them shits again. again. Uh, so I, I, I guess that would be mine. You know, it's nice and right. simple. That's I'm good. back on my Pokemon kick. Yo. That's a solid one. That's I'm nostalgic. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Mike? You got anything? Yeah. You've been man. candid as fuck. Uh, <laughs> oh, nah, bro. I'm literally always like this, yes, bro. You I love it. Yeah. It makes the me guy, The guy that y'all see posting, like, that's really me. That's like, when people oh, be yeah. saying, oh, you doing this for attention? Like, nah, nah, nah nigga, nah. I really feel this way. That's how I felt. It. But, uh, Damn, son, but nah, where'd you um, find this? So my guilty pleasure is, uh-huh. uh, all right, I've never told anybody this besides Ooh. my girlfriend. So y'all Second really get this. Second exclusive of the night. Dude, yeah. Gems. <laughs> all right. So <laughs> y'all ever seen, like, those rappers who are, like, really bad? And like they'd be like, yo, check out my new hit single. And then oh, yeah. be like, it'd be like 13 <laughs> views. And the niggas is terrible. Like he ain't on beat. Ain't nothing rhyming. The right. video look like he shot on his iPhone. It's right. all grainy and shit. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, every time I get high, I sit in my room and I watch nothing but those videos, bro. I got a whole Stupid. list of those dudes. Just people that are and, and girls fun. too. And bro, it is the funniest shit because I know. I know when they wrote this, they was in their room like, no, no, oh, nigga, I'm about to kill him. Oh, and that's why, oh, bro, go that viral. shit just be having me rolling, bro. That is, that's the shit I do. Whenever I got some free time, I pull up these niggas' new videos. So, and so, you, watch and have a so you watch that video. Uh, you know that video of that dude that's like mad extra black. He got oh, no, 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 no. orange shirt on and it went viral on Facebook. Nah, nah, nah. Like, bro. bro. Bro, oh, I ain't no. watching no viral videos. I'm watching all the shit y'all never click on. Damn. The motherfuckers that be inboxing you the songs, yeah. bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, yo, son, bro. Yo, yesterday, this? matter of fact, bro, yesterday, mm-hmm. I watched one after work. You know what I mean? I got home and I watched one after work. And uh, and Shorty was in there. She had three other dudes on the song. And she was pregnant, bro. Uh-huh. <laughs> and she was smoking and rapping gangsta. This is the craziest shit I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> I watched the video like 14 times. Uh-huh. Like, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, no, that's my guilty pleasure, man. You give wow, us the top man. three best bad rappers? I can't uh-huh. because cause I be telling them, like, yeah. yo, I really love that shit, bro. I fuck with that. <laughs> like, yo. So, so, so if I tell rap. them that it's bad, they gonna know I really feel that we way. We have yeah. a term for that <laughs> over at UGM Music Podcast with yeah. Chaz Ray. Every mm-hmm. Sunday, two we have it's a review show, so we have a term for that kind of music. Yeah, fire trash. Fire trash. Yes, fire bro, fire I fire love fire, fire trash. Fire trash. Yo, fire off trash. air, I will give y'all some fire what trash, bro. Oh my god, yo, I, I love it. Fire trash. Shout yeah. out to yeah. Chaz and UGA. Yo, yeah. yo I literally fire be watching trash. these dudes and this one chick. Well, these two chicks all the time. <laughs> and I just can't get enough of this shit. Catch so me on the ball. How about that? <clears throat> oh, man. That's hilarious. Oh, Hell yeah. All right. How about this one, guys? Uh, what's your go-to um, excuse for playing hooky from work? <laughs> Smoke <laughs> weed every day. You got one, but you seem like you got one. Where? Oh, <laughs> bro, <laughs> man, I just tell him I ain't feeling good, bro. Like, yeah. Oh, okay. He can't oh, laugh like oh, he has some right, crazy right. shit. Oh, no, nah, because it ain't that. Yeah, like, but shit, bro, if, they, not, if they and press you, them, just be like, if they huh? press you, like, oh, okay, you're not feeling good. What's wrong with you? What do you say? Oh, see, and then I just come clean. So that sound I, got, I just yeah, come right clean. 
Cause um, cause my job, no, like I'm an actor and I be modeling and uh-huh, all this other right. shit, bro. So whenever I be like, I don't feel good, and they be like, oh, what's wrong? I be like, well, this acting job is gonna pay me 800 for the day, <laughs> yeah. and I figured y'all only pay me 300. So, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go over there. And they usually just be like, okay, all right, all right. All right. Yeah. See, they want to fire me, but don't nobody know the other keys, you know? <laughs> so they can't get rid of a nigga yet. Yeah. Uh. Well, I, I got. <laughs> I got a built-in excuse. I got kids. Oh, yeah. So easy. It's just, you know, every time, hey, man, my kid's sick. I can't send them to daycare. Yep. Oh. Even when they're not sick. Sorry. You know what I'm saying? No, yo, you're doing it. My kids got a doctor's appointment. Yeah, Yeah. doctor's appointment. You know what I'm saying? So I got a built-in work excuse every day. Oh, okay. That's perfect. I like that a lot. Hell yeah. Um, Uh, What's your go-to kids (laughs) animated (laughs) movie? Oh, we actually, was, I was just talking about this with my girl the other day. It's not like one of the big name ones, so I feel like you might not know it. Inside Out. Oh, that was you ever heard of Inside yeah, Out? That's feeling. my favorite. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. my favorite animated movie. That was good. But in terms of like bigger names, one is Monsters, Inc. Monsters, Inc. Monsters, Inc. Oh. But Inside Out oh, is my yeah. personal favorite that's one. Bro. Monsters, Inc. would be number two. More yeah. popular. Yeah, yeah. But I feel more popular. But I thought Inside Out was good, too. Great. How about you, Mike? You got one? I um I actually got a new favorite man. What's um, that? I watched it the other day on Shrooms. Uh, Spirited <laughs> Away. Oh yeah, yo, this whole quarantine thing, bro. I've gotten very bro. close with God. I've yeah. spent a lot of days on Shrooms, <laughs> bro. Yeah, I have no idea. No. I got a fire plug. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. But I uh, um yeah, so I Spirited Bye. Away. Have a beautiful uh-huh. time. Uh, this this anime movie. Uh yeah, this is tough, bro. Spirited Away, said. Yeah, Spirited, Spirited is Away. Is it the one with the horse? Spirited. No, what's that? Horse. Nah, no, it's like it's like wrong. this little chick. Um, you guys are eating different get shrooms. Into, yeah. um, <laughs> 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 um, basically yeah. though, they like visions. pull up to this abandoned uh, amusement park. Okay. Uh, these ghosts turn their parents into pigs, and they start feeding them, you know, to serve to the guest, and mm-hmm. you know the other ghost, and you know she got to work with this other kid to get it out, and it's it's it's, it's, it's a whole fire ass mm-hmm. movie, man. Okay. Yeah, I mean, so yeah, it's pretty fucking good. Whenever y'all get the it. chance, you check it out. How about oh, yeah. new? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's just funny. That, that, <laughs> that was funny, but I just didn't pretty dickish, man. No, <laughs> you gotta make it. Go. Um, I'm right, Mike, your actor. I'll ask you a little uh, Dwight, but um, if you could, it's kind of similar to the recasting question, but if you could play an iconic role, what would it be? Hmm. Uh, a role that's, even if it hasn't been done, if you think there's an iconic movie about someone that hasn't been done yet make that movie but or if you want to be fucking jackie robson you could be him too (laughs) who you thinking um man uh shit bro honestly i feel like i would love to be in uh the p diddy movie uh, like if diddy ever did a movie about his life Uh uh-huh i would love to play p diddy uh a lot of people don't know I be dancing my ass off. Yeah. Uh, I don't really do it publicly, you know, because y'all always looking at me. <laughs> the home shake. Uh, the home shake. Uh, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. Nigga be busting the move. Uh, yeah. Say, I would, I would, I would love to play Diddy if you ever did a like his his biopic movie. about Diddy. You're playing Diddy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Movie, right. I would love to play P Diddy. Uh, how about you? It's actually my second favorite movie of all time. What's that? It's uh, Meet the Parents. Okay. Which I think is actually the greatest comedy movie of it's all time. So, That's it's my hilarious. opinion. I just want to play Ben Stiller in that movie because yeah. I think it's <laughs> fucking hilarious, bro. I think it's so relatable, yo. Yeah. It's just so funny as hell, bro. Uh, yo, he is just too funny in that movie. Him okay. and Robert De Niro. So I, I want to be Ben Stiller. It just I seems like, like it'll be fire. I like that. I like that. <laughs> Meet the Parents is great, bro. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Um, I got the DVD. That shit might be in my trunk. Or she know. never seen it. I'm trying to show you. No. Know? Oh, man. So there's so many classics. <laughs> Surprise, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> uh, all right, how about this also one, guys? If you got to flee the country, where you going? <clears throat> and what you do? Yeah, what did you do? <laughs> this is going to be good. <laughs> um, Catch me outside. <laughs> Man, I'm going to Italy, bro. You going to Italy? Yeah. It's, it's going to Italy. Right well, you oh, know, nah. after, <laughs> all this, after Yeah, all bro, this, but after yeah, all this, after, yo, yeah. because... Because yeah. the courts is closed right now, so we good. Yeah, see, you know. <laughs> see, so yeah, it'd be Italy. Uh, Beautiful-ass country, mad open space. Uh, 
I love Italian women. Uh, my girlfriend, she loves Italy. She's Have you been. ever been? No, I've never been. Yeah, um, I've been. I'm a big fan of the Romans. So yeah, man. I um, also love, you know, like like all that Catholic shit. Yep. So, you know what I mean? Just to be there and be able to go through and see everything. I feel like for me that would be crazy. You know what I mean, because I'm like a big, mm-hmm. like a history nerd. So okay. Another one. And what, what did you do? What, yeah, what did you do? What you oh, what did I do? Yeah. Why did you have to flee the oh, country? Bro. It's only one thing that I would ever do, bro. It's something where I either stole a whole bunch of money uh-huh. or I did something illegal to make a whole bunch of money. Okay. But it's it something money involving related. money, bro. Okay. I'm 100% one he of those sold people. a bunch of hand sanitizer <laughs> online and <laughs> got caught with no selling bro, ID. I got mad soap and paper towels, Word. so y'all holla at me, <laughs> man. Deck. You got the TP. <laughs> I ain't got no um, tissue. Where you fine. going? I'm going to uh, Cuba. Cuba. Cause nice. I'm, with I'm trying to see. That's my. That's where I'm going with it. I'm Pog? trying to see if Pox over there. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to see if that this Pox. is true or not. And what I did was fake his own death. Man. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, bro. I love my kids, right? Yeah, yeah. But other people's kids, bro. <laughs> I'm t- yo. I when I'm in public with yes. other people's kids, bro. I hate other. People's I hate kids other, so people's bad. Kids. other people's kids. Not my family's kids, my cousins, my friends' kids. Love those kids. But strangers' kids? So I probably beat up some kids, bro. Children are the worst people. They might have knocked my son over (laughs) at the park or something. And I probably beat up somebody's kids, bro. And that 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 is very illegal. You cannot (laughs) hit little kids, bro. That you do. You know what I'm saying? You cannot hit people's little kids. So that's what I did, bro. I I hit some little kids. I beat them up and I flew them. I I went to Cuba, y'all. I bro, can't stand other you just gotta kids. go to Georgia, bro. If you want to smack people's kids, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, bro, I once, nah, bro. I've seen it. I've seen it, bro. I've seen it. Oh, A little kid smacked my nephew, and my oh. little brother smacked him. It was like, go get your daddy. So, yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. You live down south, you can definitely yeah. smack somebody's children. You just gotta be willing oh. to deal with the consequences <laughs> when they come outside. But yeah, you can smack somebody's kid. Uh huh. Word. Great, <laughs> Speaking of kids. Let's say you got a chance to go back in time and see yourself. What would you tell yourself? Oh, um, go back in time. What age you going to? <clears throat> well, you got to be like teenage, you know? You got to give yourself some type of advice. Um, to be honest, I just keep it simple and, and, and just be better in school mm-hmm. and take school more serious. Because when I was a kid, yo, I was just like, fuck school. You know what I'm saying? I had that immature mindset. It was just like, fuck school. I'm not going to need this. So I I try to instill it in my kids that it's very important. And luckily, we live in Dorchester. It's right around the corner from Mass Ave. We drive on that shit all the time. So I'd be like, yo, you see all these people? Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. you this could be you like right. no offense I don't want to make an example out of them but you know what I'm saying yeah. sometimes you know what I'm saying so I would just be better in school yo because I like not to toot my own horn but before I Gordon Hayward in my goddamn foot Ooh, I was very bad? yeah it was Damn, terrible yeah, yeah, nah, nah, nah. I was very good at basketball okay. so if I was better in school and was able yeah. to play more school basketball yo because I love music but basketball is my number one thing it always will be. Yeah. So, you know, I feel like I could have did a little bit more with basketball if I was better in school and da da da. So that's I'd keep it simple and just probably do that. All right. Once Catch again. me outside, how about that? <laughs> I respect it. But uh once again, complete opposite. Yep. Uh, <laughs> I'll go back in high school. Uh, I would tell myself immediately, stop playing basketball. You're gonna Ooh. blow out not one knee, but both knees. To end. Uh Ooh. fuck this basketball shit. Mm-hmm. And fuck this school shit. Drop out now, start rapping, start acting, figure it out. Because, dog, you don't want to be here. you just wasting everybody's time, and you're going to hate college. This is what you're going to like. Yep. Your first video going to get mad views, and you ain't <laughs> never going to look back. So start now. So we got to jump start on this shit. Okay. So, yeah, Bye. that's what I would tell myself, day. man. Give yourself a jump start yeah. on your career. Because, dog, oh, yeah. fuck a plan B, bro. <clears throat> I've never maybe, had a plan B. Would you maybe, like... Write some verses that wouldn't have come for another three to four years, and be like, "Yo, these are the ones." Nah, no. bro. I don't believe in <laughs> handouts. Let it come to you? Nah, <laughs> nah, I'm gonna tell him go work on that shit. All right. Cause I, like I sit that. in that notebook right now. I uh-huh. can tell you that's some bullshit. Uh-huh. Go work on some <laughs> other shit. Get in there. All right, all right. You guys familiar with the uh, the Infinity Stones from Marvel? Nah, not me. I'm not. Yeah. Really. All right, so I'll explain them to you. You get it out of your mic. So if if you could. Wield one, which would it be? There are the time stone, which manipulates time. Space stone, um, you can go anywhere 
okay. instantly. Reality Stone, you can literally warp reality to the further ex- extension of your mind. Um, the Mind Stone, you can control people's minds, essentially, and read their minds. Power Stone, exactly how it sounds, all power. Um, and the Soul Stone, we'll, we'll leave the Soul Stone out of it, because that one you have to die for. <laughs> well, you have to kill somebody. Yeah, or kill somebody. For Someone you love. Yeah. Um, Mike could probably, Mike said he knows about this stuff. Yeah, right? but we'll, we'll <laughs> delegate to you, Mike. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, for me, man, it would be the time stone. Time stone. Uh, because people don't know this. I take a lot of chances, like literally all the time. Everything uh-huh. I do is a gamble. Uh-huh. Uh, I take a lot of <clears throat> chances. And sometimes I don't gamble right. So on the times that I've lost on gambles, I would love to just be able to hit a reverse, shoot. reverse. <laughs> yeah, you know. Uh-huh. But uh, yeah, so that'd be the one for me, easy. All right, time stone it is. That's yeah. definitely one of the more common answers, which I'm sure you hate to hear. <laughs> but uh, that, most people Surprise, go that which I'm not mad at them at all for. You guys right. get more left field questions? Nah. 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 All right, I'll leave you with this one, guys. And then we got a brand new track by myself, Apex. For it. Uh, featuring, what's your name? Brianna Marin. Marin. Uh, caught my this last. is a certified hood classic. Exactly. But last question, guys. What is the meaning of life? What the fuck? <laughs> Another one. No, a simple one. <laughs> you want to go? Uh, man, I, I could tell you what it's not. Man. All right. I, I can tell you it's not <laughs> to work these fucking dead end jobs just to make enough to get by for the day and and and, and struggle and die. Mm-hmm. I can tell you that's what it's not. And unfortunately, it just seems like for too many people that's what it is. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I go through these phases where I just fuck everybody and everything and it's unfortunate because that's how I feel like life is uh-huh. if you're not one of the elitist and fucking out there getting involved in this fucking crazy shit because yeah they make a lot of money but they're out there fucking getting involved in rape and fucking child right. molestation yep. and all that shit bro. Sex trafficking so shit. it's like if you're not one of these crazy elitists you're just living a trash life and i don't have an answer what the meaning of life is i'm, uh-huh. I'm still trying to figure that out to be honest with you i know what it's not and i that, that was my answer i'll tell you what it's not very honest you know what i'm saying Appreciate um, it. I don't know, bro. I feel like some people like 